So before swim baits were all the rage and uh, we had all the advanced uh, rigging, back in the day a grub and jig head combo in winter was absolutely deadly and nothing's changed. When pairing a grub to your jig head, this is a quarter ounce eagle claw ball head jig and actually it's got some nice features. It's a almost 90 degree line tie. It's got a relatively good gape on it and then pairing it with a grub and the advantage of this system is that you can fish it on a straight retrieve you can get the bait coming straight back at you alternatively this jig head is going to enable you to fish it through rock um, and you're not going to get snagged as much you're going to chip quite a bit of the paint off doing it but if you are you're throwing it in the right place so when swimming a grub it's a very simple presentation especially around grass edges cast the bait out you can count it down a little bit and then the idea is to point your rod tip well keep your rod tip low to the water and then just a constant retrieve we'll just keep that bait swimming like a clueless bait fish like when these fish are suspended on the edges of this weed or if you're fishing a rock if you're fishing a rock you can cast it out, let that bait fall to the bottom and work it all the way down, slack line it as soon as you feel, give it a bit of a line and it will imitate either a crustacean or a bait fish swimming around there. And when you're talking about swimming a jig or fishing a jig in winter, it is a finesse presentation. You can look for lighter fluorocarbon, a spinning setup, so medium action spinning rod and then anything that can any spinning wheel that can accommodate a lighter fluorocarbon. And you want fluoro because it gets down and it enables you to keep in contact with your bait at all times so it doesn't pendulum like a braid. And it's a simple way to target fish that may be suspended or looking for something with a bit of action. So of your three classic grub styles, this is the Yum Swimming Grub uh, and a nice bait fish profile, it's smoke blue. Then you've got your Kitek Flapper Grub this has got that classic uh, flapper tail from Kitek, so it puts out a lot of action and hasn't got too much body roll. And if you're looking for another last alternative is Zoom's tab tail grub, or if you can get hold of them, the Fat Albert. Green pumpkin is a mainstay. You can fish anywhere from Clan William all the way up to Drikopi's Dam, and you'll catch fish on these. 